Commandant M was one of 14 survivors from his regiment when they went over the top of the trenches. And uh, he was wounded, but not too badly, and ended up in a prisoner of war camp. He then came back to his career of being a cobbler after World War I. And then Grandad Foyle was also in the trenches on World War I as well. And he was gassed, but not too badly, and he survived to live a long and uh, fairly healthy life. was very, very ambitious. And apart from national service, he stayed in Barclays Bank all his life. And then my mum was a hairdresser, and uh, she worked for many years simply in that environment. It was ridiculous. I had four years of skiving about, and then about two months of incredibly intense revision just before my finals, and I, I scraped a tutu. This is for my family, and I just want to say to all of you, those who know me already because you're alive, and those who may be seeing this after I've passed, I love you, I love you, you're my bloodline. And I'd say to you, please always be kind. Follow your, follow your dreams, but don't let them obsess you. Be true to yourself, God bless you. Dad, granddad, great granddad, or whatever. Thank you.